Fido. This is my friend Fido. Sandland, the land of St. Helen. Welcome to yet another fragrance review. This time uh, it's a rare discontinued fragrance by an Italian sports brand. Sergio Tacchini. Sergio Tacchini was particularly famous in, in the world of tennis in around the 80s, right? Sergio Tacchini. You recognize the logo, you recognize the brand, and you maybe recognize this fragrance called Stile, Stile. Um, very much Italian style fragrance. Catherine de Bruy Sereni was the parfumeur behind this fragrance. Let me check the camera here a little bit. And um, I've got so much left of it. And uh, it's, it's definitely something very special here. Uh, uh, because um, the the composition, the blend, um, hosts some notes that I have rarely seen put together uh, this way uh, or any way at all. And I'm talking about fur, fur resin, uh, fig leaf, um, myrtle, cardamom and cinnamon, plus tobacco leaf and patchouli, right? That's something very, uh, very uh, special, a very special composition, and it smells accordingly. Stile is the name, and it has some wonderful style indeed. Um, really very warm, aromatic, um, embracing, uh, almost seducing your nose. Uh, it's, it's really something that smells somehow uh, very natural uh, at the same time. It's To me, it's a... It could be worn casually as well as a dress-up fragrance. It has a great personality and it's just a, it's, it has a greenness about it. It has a warmth. It has a tobacco, very distinct tobacco note in there, Stile. And, and the fig leaf and the myrtle uh, together with the fur. I mean, it's just, it's, just an, it's just a sensation to your nose that you have rarely uh, experienced. And, and so uh, I'm very sad to see this leave. Um, the same way I'm sad that Antonio Banderas uh, discontinued Antonio. That's that's the league. This is playing also in in its performance because it's really really well performing. It's um it's it's really long lasting and it's it, it really smells like a high end designer fragrance, not a sports brand uh, stuff that usually is not as um, good in terms of quality, although I have to say that Sergio Tacchini most of the times really puts out some very good um, quality fragrances. But I think if I have to look at Sergio Tacchini, and there was this uh, the 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 gray um, the gray silver one back in nineteen eighty seven, nineteen eighty seven. That was wonderful, um, and that 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 to me is a a, a um, benchmark for Sergio Tacchini in terms of quality and individual um, you know impression that that the brand had and and still probably has although these today's releases they're they're good they're still good for example I love Italy I love that fragrance is a good one as well so Sergio Tacchini uh, tries to really keep up the game in terms of, of of quality and price and good price versus quality ratio in their fragrances but still uh, to me um, tops all of the Sergio Tacchini fragrances, and the reason is that it's it's it is it is it smells fresh, okay? But it's it and it smells um, in a way. It smells very energetic, like you know, it's fitting the sport image or or sports brand image somehow, but in a different way because it's warm, aromatic, embracing. It has tobacco. Um, and the tobacco and the fig leaf, it's just, they, it, the smell this just drives you crazy because it's really, really nice. Um, and it, it does smell Italian. It smells like a a, a, a handsome, well-dressed Italian guy somewhere between 35 and 45. This is how it's, it has a little bit of a mature smell to it, but not too much again, okay? So, um, introduced in 2003, I don't know when they disc discontinue this. I. I, I uh, discontinued this, but I st I don't see it around at all anymore. So it must be, I think it must be more than 10 years now at this stage. But definitely my statement is that if you're looking for a warm, um, embracing, aromatic, yet still fresh fragrance that has a very special style character, 
um, and blends notes unexpectedly and unexpected notes together. Um, Seju Takini Stile is, is one of the best options that you could get. Unfortunately, um, not available anymore, as, as I say, and probably online is going to be you know, more expensive than it was in its heyday. Okay, so um, what I'm going to reach for is not much left in here. I'm going to reach for this um, at occasions when, when I just want to have a wow factor. And imagine that you get a wow factor for a simple little fragrance like Stile from Sergio Tacchini. That makes you think uh, about high-end designer and overly expensive niche fragrances, doesn't it? So thanks very much. This was Chris with um, with uh, De Bruyne Sereni's wonderful, wonderful work. Stile by Sergio Tacchini from 2003. And um, last but not least, Fido. Fido. Here's my friend Fido again. So thanks very much and uh, see you soon, Fido. See you soon for yet another fragrance review. Bye.